Good morning and welcome back. This is video number four about uh, learning uh, machine learning with Python and Azure. So in the previous video, uh, the last line we executed uh, was this one uh, where we plot uh, the boxes uh, and we saw that there were not outliers anymore. Now, in this last video, we are going to train a model. We are not going to focus on the statistics or mathematics behind it. We are just going to do it by code and use test data to prove uh, the accuracy of it. So for this, we are going to use the sklearn.model selection library. Then we are going to reset the index of the scale data and categorical data. That's something that, we, if you remember from the previous video, uh, we, st we standardize uh, the values uh, from the numerical values to a standardized version of it. Uh, then we are going to concatenate the scale data and categorical data in one uh, full data set, let's say. Why? Because we need both numerical values and categorical values like Bluetooth, 4G, 3G, indeed, etc., to, to do the predictions. Then we are going to check if we have any null values on the, on the data set. We have nothing yet. Then we are going to plot uh, again. And you can see we have a the some uh, numerical values in some range which are very close to each other and other which has which have a number very close to zero. Then we are going to split or drop the price range uh, column into a different uh, data frame say. Why? Because that's uh, the the field or the column we want to predict with this uh, logistic regression, okay? Then what we need to do is we have some rows, 1,900 something. We want to split the rows between train data and test data. And what we are doing here is uh, we are putting different data frames. 20% uh, of the of the rows will be test and the rest is going to be training data. And this is going to be randomized with the random state that you see here. Okay. Then we can check the shape of both data sets. So 1596 is the train data, 399 is the test. Okay. And now we are going to use the logistic regression from the sklearn.linear model library. So we are going to use the LBFGS solver, a multi class, multi multinomial, and maximum 1000, 10,000 iterations. So, as I explained before, we are not going to focus on the statistics behind this uh, thing, but we will see it in the future. So, stay tuned. So we instantiate the class, we call the logistic regression function, and then we train it. And at the end, we got the following. So the score, uh, basically what it does, it uses test data to see how well is our model. So here we have 93.48%. So our model accuracy is 93 point something percent. So which is quite high. So in the next models, we will go further into, into the training and testing scenario. And we will see uh, further uh, use cases that we can use with the same data. 
So this, the last three, four videos were just in introductory to, to Python so that you can quickly go and train your data and then test it, uh, clean it, removing outliers. And I hope this video was also informative as well. So stay tuned for other videos in the next coming days. Thank you.